Hello, welcome to Genius on Genius with Ryan McKee. I'm here today with an evolutionary psychology genius, Russell Jackson. Russell, how's it going? Good. So, evolutionary psychology in general began actually with Charles Darwin, who suggested that the ways in which natural selection could occur could also occur with behavior. So evolutionary psychologists look at the environments in which humans evolved in order to better understand our behaviors and cognitions today. I love my girlfriend very much. Why do I want to have sex with other girls? I common training component to evolutionary psychology is looking at how genes propagate. The genes that are contained within a female are passed on to her offspring and that requires a lot of time. So access to a lot of males really isn't a limiting factor as to how many of her genes make it into the next generation. The genes that inhabit us today were selected based upon successful ancestors doing things that would result in the greatest number of their genes in the following generation. For a male, the ways in which he was doing it is by mating with multiple females. I think I could pull that off and get menage a trois. Cool. Science is science. Have you ever used that in class? Not to my knowledge. Some say science is science, but is science science? Physics? Chemistry? Huh? That makes sense. And art! Let's go. Let's three go together. Does evolutionary psychology attempt to explain homosexuals? The hypotheses tested by evolutionary psychologists, of which I'm aware, look at men in competitive mating environments. One of the costs of competing in that environment is you could get your ass kicked. You could die. So to not put an end to your genes right then would be to not go for the women. I have to be honest, I got lost in your eyes as you were explaining that. If evolutionary psychology was a music genre, would it be hair metal or grunge? What may have started out as punk is probably different now, though. Now it might. So, be... do you guys like walk into a conference and just start pushing around the other psychologists? Hey, Egghead. <laughs> you know, maybe maybe not that forcefully. It might be along the lines of, "Did you see my last publication?" So. So, that's, that's an academic smackdown. Sure. Because science is science. 